you doing in here all by your lonesome? Nearly everyone's in the parlor playing games till you're ready to make your big announcement and open your gifts. Well, they're going through the motions. Nobody's really interested in Monopoly or Clue. I know a better game. Now, now, sweet pea. For all I know, I might be the one you're playing to fire or whatever. You? Have you been up to no good, Peggy Sue? Of course not. I wouldn't do anything to hurt you, honey lamb. But someone could have told you I was. A laborer, for instance. She hates me. You know, I just hate it when somebody hates me. Allegra has never said a word against you. If she hasn't, it's because she's afraid to. I'm sure she suspects I'm more than an employee to you, but she doesn't dare confront you about it. You think so? Well, sure. I'm too smart to let some fortune hunter take me for millions. <laughs> but before you leave her, she gets to live like a queen. Allegra has ridden the merry-go-round long enough. It's someone else's turn. Why? Who knows? You might have finally found the woman you'll be willing to spend the rest of your life with. We'll see, Peggy Sue. After tonight, there could be quite a few changes around here. Fine. If you'll excuse me, I have to go into one of the upstairs bathrooms <coughs> and freshen up. Don't you go and reveal your big secret till I get back. I don't suppose you'd be willing to tell me who it is. You're planning to reprimand, would you? I can't do that, Peggy Sue. Even if a pal? Even if you have it. Well, then, I won't waste the puppets. They make those little lines around your mouth anyway. I'll be back in a few seconds later. <laughs>